first connect data source. So we're gonna use sample super store here. Okay. First, we need to change our chart type to pie because we want to display sales amount by segment. Um, we're gonna move segment into colors and drag sales into angles. All right. Um, now we have a pie chart here. I'm gonna make it a little bit bigger. Okay, I'm gonna create calculate field. Name it number of <clears throat> record we used to have in the previous version. We no longer have since 2020.2. Okay, and we're gonna right click and drag into rows, and you will get the type of the aggregation here. So I'm gonna choose min. Okay, and you have this one. And press and hold the control key and click this one to make it duplicate it. Okay, now uh, we have two separate pie chart here. And click this one, select the dual axis. And you will notice there are two cards created for each pie chart. Okay. And I'm gonna click this one and hide header. Okay. And I'm gonna make this one a little bit bigger. Okay. And second one, maybe uh, this much. And I'm gonna remove this one. And you will see uh, how it looks like. And change the color to white, okay? And it make it look like a donut, okay? And a little bigger and this big. We have a donut pie chart here and you just uh, move the label you want to show. Okay, I'm gonna move some Okay, and segment. Okay, and maybe change the order. And maybe percentage of the sales. Uh, I'm gonna change this uh, some sales to different calculation, such as percent. So we have a percentage here. I'm gonna drag another uh, sales. So we have total sales amount actual number so I'm gonna change your format to currency to display with dollar sign here all right and I want to show some total amount in the middle so I'm gonna move to second pie chart here and so move this one to label so we have a total amount here so I'm gonna change a little bit of um, the format here, I'm gonna make it bold, bigger, and maybe. Okay. Thank you for watching and take care. Bye, everyone.